Hi friends, uh, welcome to Aditya RP Academy, BTM Layout Bangalore. Now we are continuing to work with the exception hang that is advanced. So in this video, we are going to see the use of preserve the type and detail of the current exception. And go to blueprint. So here I have created one process. The name is the preserve the detail of current exception. So here I am creating like one exception, like intentional exception that is 1 divided by 0. So here I am using like two data items, so one is x and other one is y. So x and the data type is number, initial value is 1 and open another uh, data item, name is y, type is number and initial value is 0 and drag and drop on calculation stage. So x divided by y then resides in y so link the stages so reset it it is showing like zero errors but will raise an exception the internal exception is is raised an internal exception that is failed to evaluate an expression x divided by y that is division by zero and use recover stage reset it and then drag and drop recover stage So reset it and then run it and the exception cached by recover stage but still it is raising one issue that is like a fail to find stage linked from stage recover one just click on ok then reset it and then drag and drop on exception stage so open the exception stage here I'm not giving any exception type or exception details whatever and straight away I'm connecting resume recover stage to resume uh, like an exception stage so reset it and then run it So if you observe here, it's raised an, like a blank exception, blank message and reset it and then open the exception stage and select the check button that is preserve the type and detail of the current exception. Then click on OK. So reset it and then run it. Again, the previous exception was raised. So if you observe here, so without preserve the type and detail of the current exception the stage exception stage generates a new exception and we did not enter any exception type or exception detail in the exception stage properties and that's why the message was nearly almost like a blank and critically the original and original exception the one caught by the recovery stage and is still alive and although this won't appear to present a problem in this simple example when this mistake is present like in more complex and many multi layer solution unhandled exceptions like this will cause like a problems and so with the you know, by selecting preserve the type and detail of the current exception the exception caught by the recovery stage is re-released or rethrown by the exception stage and that's why the message was like a division by zero and moreover the current exception is really you know uh, Okay, let me run the process once again you can see the whole exception like an earlier exception there is like an x divided by y that is like you know uh, division by 0 means it's still alive thank you